probably take my glasses off because there's a glare, most likely. I don't need glasses, those are just computer glasses because I don't want to go blind. Anyway, <laughs> this is a book that I read recently. It's called Start With Why, Simon Sinek. And basically that book is meant for leaders, but I genuinely believe that every single person that wants to tell their story or that wants to put their story out into the universe, I think that they should read this book. There's a question that I like asking my friends. If they were to run into a stranger on the street and that stranger were to ask them who they were, what would you tell them? People will start obviously with their name and they'll immediately go to their job. You never really get to the why. You never really get to why you're doing what you're doing, why you exist, what your purpose is. And when it comes to telling your story, purpose is the most important part because anybody can do the job that you're doing. Anybody can make as much money as you're making. Not everybody has the same purpose as you, has the same goals as you. It might be similar, but your goals define who you are, define what you do, define every single decision that you ever make in your entire life. I will remember, there's a screen door. <laughs> I feel like at this point, I'm just choosing random places in my backyard to film. Also realize that I am choosing the worst time to film. It's noon, so the sun's like right above me, so it casts this ugly shadow. Yeah, so all I'm trying to get with this video is, uh, I just wanna help you guys realize that your story does matter and your story begins with why. Nobody cares about what you do, they care about why you're doing it. Everybody does the same thing, but the reason why they're doing it is completely different. I mean, well, not completely different. It could be similar in ways, but it's completely unique to you. I'm gonna set this down because I haven't gone to the gym in a while and my arm hurts. <laughs> a couple years ago, I got this tattoo. I think I got it on Halloween, so it was like $20. It's a question mark on the back of my neck. The guys at the tattoo shop thought that I was a super uh, big Dr. Riddle fan. I think it's like a Batman reference. Anyway, the reason why I actually got that tattoo was because there was a period in my life where I just didn't question anything. I went with the flow, I did what people told me to do, I didn't think twice about it. It wasn't until I dropped out of college when I started questioning if the things that I was doing actually related to my purpose, to my goal in life. And the reality is that it didn't. It had nothing to do with my goals, with my purpose. And so I got that tattoo as a reminder to stay curious, to keep questioning things, and to always just ask questions and to always strive to learn more. There's always something new that you can learn about yourself and about the world. And your purpose, your goals will change and will shape and become more refined over time. All right, you guys, heading to the office. It's pretty late, honestly. Okay, so the reason why I'm emphasizing why so much is because why and knowing what your purpose is, knowing your why is the first step to telling your story. The entire point of this video is you want to find your why. You want to find your purpose. That is the very first step when telling your story. So for instance, for me, the reason why my purpose, my goal in life is to help other people tell their stories is because I know what it's like to feel alone. I know what it's like to feel like nobody cares about you or your business. So my goal with everything that I do is to help you guys understand that you matter and that your story matters. It has nothing to do with money. It's something that really resonates deep inside of me. So I encourage you guys when creating your stories to figure out your why, to figure out your purpose, that will be the thing that will guide you through this journey of telling your story to the rest of the world.